Hi, I'm Don Braid, political columnist for The Herald. Well, today is the day of the Premier's kitchen table speech. There's the speech. You'll see the table in the video. The Premier is trying to reassure people that uh, the government's got a grip on this situation. She talks about the strength of Albertans, about getting through it all together. She doesn't talk much about specifics, so that's for the budget next week, but she does promise a substantial job creation program. There are four points to that, perhaps the most interesting of which she alludes to is some kind of job creation incentive program for business that will replace the 27,000 job program the NDP dumped because there's no point in telling people directly they get $5,000 for a new job when they're already laying people off. So uh, she is ki kind of tough on Ottawa. She, she says that if Alberta is going to keep supporting the rest of Canada, the rest of Canada has to support us. We need pipeline. She also complains about the lack of EI coverage in the Edmonton area. Uh, there's, uh, but mostly it's about tone, it's about reassurance. The t tone of the speech is very calm to the point of somnolence. That's a very well-organized kitchen table, I must say. I wish I had one like that. Uh, but they're hoping just to sort of calm things down, get people ready for a very tough budget with a $10 billion deficit.